All right, all right. It is Friday. That means it is Football Friday here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network and the Mike Prince Show. Welcome to the Friday edition. Don't forget, you can follow us on social media and Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, all at the Mike Prince Show. The YouTube channel is Open Mic Broadcast Network. The website, obnradio.com, and our 24-hour dial-in message line is 713-570-6736. And without any further delay, we'll jump right into today's episode. Are you one of the many Americans that deal with the effects of diabetes? Diva Skin Conditioner could be the remedy that you need. Diva Skin Conditioner is a formulation that was designed with you in mind. Diva Skin Conditioner comes with a money-back guarantee. That's how confident they are in their product. For more information, visit DivaFeet.com. That's D-I-V-A-H, Feet.com. Or you can speak with a representative by dialing 903-270-0026. This is Eric Dooley, the head football coach at Prairie View a and University, the home of the Panthers, and you're listening to the Open Mic Broadcast Network. Let's face it, from time to time, we'll have a need for an attorney, whether it's the case of a DUI, DWI, or any other circumstances that would find you on the other side of the law. Attorney Lee Van Richardson, located at 1047 Austin Street, is the one to call. Attorney Lee Van Richardson and his staff are equipped to help you get through your legal battles. Attorney Lee Van Richardson, 979-826-8008 in Hempstead, Texas. Well, with it being football Friday, everybody still excited. Everybody's still buzzing. Feedback keeps coming in. Had a couple of inquiries that asked me, hey, man, a great show. Are you all about Prairie View? Well, no, no, I'm from Prairie View as far as my alma mater and my allegiance. But my allegiance is to the conference as a whole. You know, as I continue to reflect on the SWAC media day that just passed and all the synergy that was in the room, you can't help but to be proud to be attached to this conference. When I say to be attached to this conference, I'm speaking in the magnitude of knowing that what you're doing is making a difference. It might not be a huge, impactful difference right off the bat. But when you keep chipping and plugging away, eventually the message gets heard. Eventually, the cause is understood. And eventually, everyone starts moving in the right direction. And when I say this, I'm saying this from the depths of my heart. I am truly, truly proud of each institution that is connected that makes up this conference. Now, of course, I'm going to be PV supportive, but we want to make sure that everyone who wants to have a voice on this platform to represent your institution, you can do so. Now, you might not have a weekly permanent slot, but we will allow you to get a chance to share your love, support your school, And I guess from occasion, you can talk a little smack if you want to, as long as we're going to do it in respect and order. You can have a little fun. We're all about having fun. But just overall spread the love of Swag Nation. You'll have an opportunity to do that 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Simply dialing in on the message line, 713-570-6736. You can leave your spiel and talk your talk about your SWAC Nation School or your MEAC Nation School and let it be known to the rest of our listening audience on how you feel. You could have a game pick of the week, which reminds me, by the way, we're even looking for a correspondent who can help cover more on that eastern side of the conference. So if you or anyone that you think may have an interest, you can direct message me by way of Twitter at the Mike Prince Show. Or you can even leave your information on the message line, 713-570-6736. So it is a 
balanced attack, if you would. But we love what we're doing, and we're trying to maximize it by providing you quality programming. And thank you all so much for the continued feedback and the support. And remember, you can become a listening partner by visiting the website, obnradio.com. Click on the PayPal button. And make your donation to become a listening partner. We asked if you could to commit to 17 cents a day, which comes out to $5 a month, $60 a year. You'd be amazed that when people commit to the listening partnership, it does help continue to stretch us out to bring you these coverages. We love it, and we're going to continue to do it as long as as the breath is in our body and our mind is in right, solid place. So visit their website today, obnradio.com. Become a listening partner today. And if you happen to be in the position of not being able to afford the $5 a month, you might can only afford to do a one-time donation. Whatever it is, it is truly appreciated. We don't want to put any pressure on anyone But do know and understand that we all benefit off of each other. And anything that you can do to show your support will go an extremely long way. OBNRadio.com Well, the camps will be starting off within the next couple of weeks. The Panthers will be meeting August the 1st. They'll actually kick off August 3rd. And before you know it, August 31st will be here, Labor Day Classic, the Panthers and the Tigers. Clarence McKinney coming out of the gate for the first time as the head coach for Texas Southern. The ghost, Eric Dooley, will be in his second year. A lot of moving parts from both sides of camp. McKinney, as we mentioned, in his first year as the head coach, but it's not his first rodeo. He's been involved with big programs, University of Houston, Texas A&M. Arizona. He's had success everywhere he's gone. Coach Dooley got a year under his belt, five and six out of the gate the first time. He's learned a few things. He's going back to the lab, even though he'll be down in OC. Not a real big sweat off the back of Dooley because his background and pedigree is at OC. So I can see him just kind of sliding, walking right down the middle and uh, handling both of those duties. We'll see how effective they'll be, but it'll be something that'll be monitored along the way. We've made the pointed, noted mention of the log jam that's at the quarterback position for Prairie View. Coach Dooley says it's a, a great luxury to have. And I think the inquiries for everyone on the Panther side would be, the development of the offensive and defensive lines. How will they hold up? Not the first half, but the second half. You put a lot of pressure on your defense, in particular that of the line, even though you have a high-powered offensive scheme, it becomes a runoff, if you would. So you would hope that the defense will be able to, to stiffen his neck, create some turnovers. And I think that is probably one of the greatest improvements that the Panthers will be seeking is turnovers, creating turnovers, and creating the opportunities to keep that offense on the field as long as you can, as often as you can. And the only thing that that I have, and it's not just uh, the Dooley spread, it's all spreads, they – are so quick to move, 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 that sometimes you could move too fast and not be in tune with your defensive side of the ball, and you're moving so quick, and sometimes you get three and outs, and your defense had a, had a chance to collect themselves, and they're right back on the field. So those are kind of things, clock management and just assessing how they interact as far as being a good defense while on offense. And when I say that, Stretching that clock out. You can go fast. You can go spread because the spread and the no huddle offense is to make sure sometimes you'll find the right personnel that you like to take advantage of. You can line up to the line. Doesn't mean you have to huddle, which you'll never know. And if you see 
them guys trying to make a switch, then you can actually snap the ball. And if you don't get anything else, you get a five yard penalty for too many men on the field and just to catch them off. But you have 30 seconds. Was it 40 seconds? I forget. 30, 40 seconds in between plays. Milk that joker. Milk it. Even if you go three and out, and we'll just go 30 seconds for uh, uh, safe keepsakes. If you go 30 seconds and you know, no, I think it is actually 40 seconds. You go 40, you got 40 seconds between your last play and the next snap. And you can line up at the huddle. You know, they like to look over to the sides now and all that. And um, I was talking with one of the coaches. I can't even remember who exactly it was. But all the spread offense is right now, the RPO is nothing but the misdirection in shotgun or pistol form. It used to be underneath the center. Now you are in a pistol position where you can get a better look, a little bit more time. You might have a second or two of time to read and develop what needs to be developed. You fake it to your up back. If it looks open, you let them have it. All it is a dive to the left, a dive to the right. You don't like what you're seeing, you pull it out. You either run to your left or right with the opportunity of running or passing. Which leads back to the potential quarterbacking situation that the Panthers are going to have and that other conference schools are going to have. With the way offensive schemes are running right now, it seems that everybody wants that athletic, durable quarterback. Basically a running back with the ability to throw. And is that the cure-all for the teams at hand? Yes, you would love to have an athletic, agile quarterback. But I want to be able to have a quarterback who has the ability to throw deep, to throw that mid pass, and to dump it off when need to dump it off. But more than anything, I need that quarterback to be a leader on and off the field. I need that quarterback to be a quick thinker on his feet. And I need that quarterback to be able to know when it's necessary to run and when it's necessary to maybe slide to the left, slide to the right to buy that extra time. So all of the dust will begin to get settled here real soon. Don't forget, you can check us out daily here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network. We have Carlos Brown that featured here on Saturday mornings from 10 to 12 noon. We have another little special treat or two that we're looking forward to having to introduce to you. And we're just truly excited. Don't forget, we also have our Friday night high school broadcast coverage here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network. We'll also have our Blend Buccaneer football coverage here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network. And, of course, everything that has to do with the Southwestern Athletic Conference will have our weekly show with Coach Eric Dooley right here on the network. And we have a couple of other coaches who are committed to be on with us each and every week right here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network. Hello to the radio guy and all of those black fans out there. It's Kimberly Runnels, president of the Prairie View A&M University National Alumni Association, inviting each of you to our athletic summit being held at our 45th annual convention, Saturday, July 27th at 1 p.m. at the Houston City Place Marriott in Spring, Texas. We're inviting everyone to come out, meet and greet our athletic director, Fred Washington, our men's basketball coach, Byron Smith, and our head football coach, Eric Dooley. Go to our webpage at www.pbualumni.org register for our 45th annual convention. See you there. Don't forget to support those who help support us, Diva Skin Conditioner. Their website is divafeet.com, D-I-V-A-H, feet, 
com. You can speak with a representative by dialing 903-270-0026. The Prairie View Athletic Club, located in the beautiful city limits of Prairie View, supporting Panther Athletics since 1986. You can call today to make a donation or simply become a member by dialing 936-857-5817. And Attorney Lee Van Richardson, a valued partner here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network, and a valued attorney in your time of need. Whatever your legal matter may be, you need to give a visit to Lee Van Richardson. The address is 1047 Austin Street in Hempstead, Texas, or you can simply dial at 979-826-8008. Well, my time has come. Well, I must exit stage left. Don't forget to join us tomorrow morning, 10 a.m. for the Carlos Brown Show. Visit the website, obnradio.com. You can follow me on Twitter at the Mike Prince Show. And our 24-hour dial-in message line, 713-570-6736. And until the next time, you guys be blessed. And we'll see you on the other side.